does india have a vision for where it will be after 100 years of independence just like the chinese have it well i don't know if the indian leadership has a vision for that because we don't know who's going to be in power in 2047 india doesn't have a stable political system anything can happen at any time a new political party comes to power and they will reverse all the policies of the previous political system or the party that's what we have seen time and again and again and sometimes when you have these coalition governments that come to power for 3 months or 5 months they they basically put in disastrous policies like what ik gujral did he basically exposed all the indian intelligence assets in pakistan even moraji they said that these were people who came to power because of coalition politics so india's political system isn't stable right and therefore the political leaders they only have a vision for what they want to achieve in their own political party and when you have a strong leader like right what we have right now even their tenure is not certain right i mean who knows what's going to happen in the next election one hopes it continues but uh, we don't know so the political system isn't stable it doesn't give you a great deal of certainty in the long run and therefore this system ensures that india's leadership doesn't have a long term vision of where india wants to be i i am sure some leaders have a long term vision of where india wants to be but that vision isn't certain right because of the vagaries of the indian political system in the case of china the chinese communist party will most likely be there until uh 2049 when it will be 100 years of their independence of the of the coming to power of the chinese communist party so they have political continuity they have a continuity of policies and all that and therefore they are able to build a vision they are able to have a vision and work towards that in the case of india's so called democratic chaotic system it's very hard to work towards a vision election after election but india should have a vision of where it wants to be india should in 2047 be at least a 20 trillion dollar economy india should have a full fledged space program india should have people on the moon hopefully people on mars as well india should have a proper blue water navy india should have resolved the tibet issue and the pok issue and the pakistan issue and the afghanistan issue right india should be in my opinion that one of the top two countries in the world by 2047 that should be india's vision india's living standard should be way ahead of where they are today right india's per capita gdp should put the it in the middle income nations at least right india should have revamped its education system and become much more confident culturally than what it is today so these are some of the things that india should aspire to and that's the kind of vision india should have but will india's political system allow that we don't know i hope it does so that's the kind of vision india should have in my personal opinion